Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. Why do I have these earphones? <sighs> hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. If you don't know me, my name's Cassie, and today we are going to be taking off this face that I did earlier today. The time is now 10 11 p.m., and I did my makeup around 12 o'clock today, so yeah, it's time for me to take it off. But today we are going to talk about college. Bruh. <laughs> Now, today for me was a very, 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 very emotional day for me today because, for one, hold, let's take it back from the beginning. I graduated in 2016 from high school and I went to community college and I was supposed to transfer to university after that. Now, I remember, um, if you watch my old videos, I was... In Washington DC going to Howard um deciding to go to Howard University but that never happened because money wise I just don't really believe in paying for school like I don't know why I just rather not go to school instead of paying for it so I was like you know what let me just weigh my options and go to school in Florida did that and I was like yeah you know finished get my AA finish out school oh but first let me tell you what I'm using makeup makeup remover i'm using this college collagen makeup removal wipes um risque beauté i think this is like french or spanish and i got it from rocks for 3.99 i wanted to try something different because any like every time i wear makeup around my eyes and then i use like um what is that makeup brand called i get it from walmart um in the makeup section i'll post the picture of it and show you guys it just irritates my eyes burn my eyes so much so i think it's just the amount of chemical that's in the wipes when i'm using to take it off i wait on my options then um i go to florida um school in florida so i applied to fiu got accepted i applied to a couple of schools actually i applied to howard bowie or bowie however you say it um in a school in tuskegee and i got accepted to all those schools and i just chose to go to school in florida to save money because you know I really don't want to pay for school and I don't want to put my parents in that you know situation because I just don't really believe I don't care if they have the money or if they don't I don't believe in paying for school now um so I get my AA and everything and Everything's all gravy. I get accepted to FIU. I'm excited to go finish out my two years and get my bachelor's for business marketing. Now, it's a problem to go because I haven't taken my prerequisites that I needed for business marketing. Now, when I was at Broward College, my major was criminal justice. So, if you are going to school and you choose to go to a university, a college before university, make sure key like very important for you to know what major you're doing because i don't i don't see how i don't see how people switch their majors like and in the long run i don't see how people switch their majors now because it's really difficult and it's gonna cost you a lot of money in the long run so this whole thing is pretty much called excess credit surcharge so let's take it back a little um to get your aa at bar community college i live in florida it's 60 credits and i was taking those credits for my criminal justice major now when it was time for me to go to fiu i switched my major to business business marketing and i was missing like seven classes like stats um stats and like two other maths and economics microeconomics macroeconomics and i was like you know what i'll just thug it out take them classes but apparently it's to take them at F the university that you transfer to it's like double the tuition like double the cost being that i was going to take seven classes at fiu that i needed prereq prerequisites for my business marketing major those classes would cost me 25 2500 in the end when it was time for me to graduate with my bachelor's at FIU. So I was like, you know, let me just thug it out and go to BC and then, you know, it'll be less because that's what the advisor told me. So he was like, go back to Broward College, you know, and take them classes and, you know, so it won't be so much. It's going to be cheaper. So I said, you know, you're right. I'm going to do that. I'm going to go to Broward College and take those classes. Now, so I've taken the classes and 
I pick four classes because you know, because I'm like, you know what? I need to finish school fast. I need to get this degree and get it over with. Let me take as much class as I can right now. So I'm taking four classes currently: two maths and two economical classes, and um, they're going pretty well, but. I don't need to take these classes and I'm gonna tell you why I didn't need it I don't need to take these classes so um taking these classes now and I pay for them out of pocket because apparently my financial aid didn't go through because whole 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 a whole thing this was another mess that my mother's tax stuff wasn't like linked to the FAFSA so like woman and my password wasn't working so I had to call them every day faithfully asking them why my password's not working then the next problem was oh you can't link it because of this this situation you're blocked out then you can't do this and, th and then the next situation was oh you can't do this because it's not going through so you need to bring in a transcript so you have to call the IRS and then you have to wait five business days and then in the end everything just went through right so I'll remind you I'm on the phone with them faithfully every single day now when the financial aid problem is completely okay I call them and say, hey, listen, why my financial aid still not going through? Like, what, why, why? So they say, oh, you know, you're not a non-degree seeking student. I'm just taking classes. Well, what am I taking classes for? Like, I'm like, why am I, what do you mean what I'm just taking class? I'm taking classes, yeah, to get a, to get my degree. She's like, no, you're just taking classes. I'm like, yeah, I'm taking classes. What do you mean? She's like, you're not taking classes in a degree program. I'm like, okay, so y'all just not telling me this every after every single time I'm on the phone with y'all faithfully. Now, I go to an advisor and I'm like, boo hoo, crying. I'm like, boo hoo, crying. Because I'm like, this is ridiculous. The lack of communication is just absurd and out of control. How can y'all do it? Like, I'm just going ham. And then I met with an advisor saying, he's like, listen, um, you can listen whatever the advisor told you at FIU was like bullcrap because you're gonna still pay the same amount no matter what it's gonna be you're gonna go over to excess credit surcharge for your bachelor's degree mind you the bachelor's degree is a credit is 120 I was gonna go over 120 because I was taking extra classes that I didn't need being that I switched my major so so um so I'm like, okay, well, what can you do for me? Because I need y'all to pay for, I need financial aid to cover for this semester. And y'all need to hurry up and fix it. So he's like, you know what, you know, you can just get your bachelor's at Barrow College. And I'm like, I don't want to, but do I have a choice right now? Um, he's like, you can, um, you can go to the to the college, but just remember you're gonna have to take those prerequisites that you need. Again, these dang old prerequisites. Listen, when you go to college, my more of this whole video is to know what you want to do. Know what you want to do because switching your major last minute is gonna bite you in the ass in the long run. Excuse my French, but it's gonna bite you in the ass. The arse. <laughs> so I'm like, you know what? I'm over this. Just let me be in a bachelor's program here. Let me hurry up and finish school. Let me just get my bachelor's degree so I could try to get a good job. And I'm, I was going to major in business marketing, but they don't even have it at my Broward College. So usually I would have some like oil eye makeup remover, but I ran out. And I just happened to, yet not to make it to the store. But back to school now. Um... So I have to wait to get accepted into the bachelor's program at Broward College um, and pretty much just wait. It's a waiting game and just find out if they're going to run me my money because your girl don't. I I'm really like I truly honestly don't believe in paying for school. I don't know why. Like, I don't know. But you pay for stuff like you pay for what you get. You know what I'm saying? Like. The more money you pay, the more quality you're going to have. Like, the more quality and better it's going to be. So, it's just the way our system is. And I was just really, like, so I was like, you know what? I'm ready not just to drop out of college. Like, this isn't for me. I'm just going to call it a quits. Just find a side hustle and make mola. Like, 
I was about, I was literally this close. I was crying every day. I was like, you know what? This is just God telling me, humble yourself, child, because some people really don't qualify for financial aid and they really have to come out of pocket. And it's just like, dang, is school really that worth it? Really? Now I'm gonna use this MAC Cleanse Off Oil. I really love this because this just gets the job done. And then I use this makeup rag from um Morphe. And then I'm just going to put some in my hand. Rub it on my face. And then I still got some on my hands. And just wipe. Wipe, 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 wipe. I find this very easy to take off makeup because it's just going right off. Especially with this, like this combo and this combo is so amazing. Like this is a great combo to take off your makeup. And then I have one more step. I'm gonna go wash my face. So I need to do a re-up on my skincare game. That's pretty much it. And I'm going to go finish the rest of my nightly routine, shower, eat brush my teeth, call it in the night, do some homework, and I just want to thank you guys for watching this video and listening to me writing about school, and I just really want y'all to take care of this information, like, when you're going to school, make sure you know what you want to do, and if you're going to a college, make sure you definitely know what you want to do. I know as much as it seems like going to college, like, and not knowing what you want to do, no. Know what you want to do because that's how to get you in the end. That is exactly how to get you in the end. But thank you all so much for watching this video. I usually don't do this, but I just had to rant. And I was like, you know, I need to step up my game with videos. And here you go. So thank you all for watching. Make sure you like and subscribe. And tell me how your college experience is. I want to know how is it going and if it's going better than mine. Mine isn't bad, but it could be better. But just tell me how yours is going. Night.